What I have here are two bases, each with a dedicated transmitter, LT transmitter, and both being received by a single LR receiver on the pedal board over here. I'm going to show you how you can adjust the gain going into the transmitter. And this is very uh, unique because um, I can actually adjust the gain separately for each base, which allows me to balance the outputs of two completely different bases that one here is active and one is passive. And this is something you can't do with a chord. If you have these guitars connected to your amp with chords, the only way you can change that gain is by resetting or changing your amplifier. You don't want to have to do this. So this is a tremendous advantage of using these wireless systems. On the transmitter, the way I'm going to do this is I'm going to press the menu button, which will bring up this on-screen menu. And the first item there is gain. I'll press it again because that's what I want to adjust. And by adjusting these up and down buttons, I can move the gain up or down. Um, the first thing you notice on this is if I play the instrument that's associated with this, you'll see there's a little VU meter. I don't know of any other transmitter that has a VU meter, which allows you to see the signal going into the transmitter. This is tremendous. It's a great idea. And there it is. We also see on the top various lights lighting up. We have two signal lights, minus 10 and minus 20 dB. And the recommendation is that the light flickers on red just for a split second. So I'm going to dial this up and I'm going to play the, a note so that we can see that red light there. And there is the red light. Now that's the recommendation is that it comes on momentarily. I would back it down a little bit. I'm much more of a dynamic bass player. And if you are a dynamic bass player, if you're a slap player, for example, using a lot of quiet notes and loud notes, you will want to back this down so that you do not overload the transmitter. So I'm going to back this down to, let's try around there. There's my signal. I've got both lights coming on and they're both green. The tiniest little bit of red there. I might even back that down one more. That's good for me. So that's how I would set up the gain. Now, to balance the two instruments, it's pretty simple. All I do is switch between them on the transmit on the receiver on the on the pedal board and compare the sound, and I can adjust one up and down with respect to the other one and get the exact balance that I want. And these two I've already balanced them up. And if we switch between them, we can hear the levels. Both of those sound very well balanced to me. They sound equal. Now that I've done that, I need to back out on the transmitter back to the home page. And that's as simple as hitting the back button. Back to the menus, back to the home page. And that's it. They're set for gain structure and they're set for balance.